my brothers and sisters. It is a great pleasure for all of us to greet and be with so many of you. Often we find that there are but few who would contact us. Often we feel that our task is a difficult one and that our labors seem to go so often unrewarded and are even met with rejection. Therefore, perhaps you can understand the deep pleasure and satisfaction that we feel in receiving communication from you. Now, my friends, for some of you who have not heard from us before and ask exactly why we are here, we're here to offer ourselves as spiritual channel through which we are hoping to spread the knowledge of love and its energy to those of you who are truly seeking. But essentially, we are speaking of at the spiritual growth of each one of you. Now, at a later time, you will find through your explorations many chances to help others with questions, such as we help you. My friends, as with ourselves, we in return gain a more spiritual understanding through the helping of others. We are also here, my friends, to spread the understanding of meditation. As we were saying, our purpose for being among your people at this time has to do with providing a wider understanding of the concept of love to your people. We have only limited means for being of this type of service, for we respect each individual's rights, each individual's free will choices, and many would not wish to hear the message which we bring, our experience, the means by which we communicate it. Therefore, Though we wish to be of the most possible service, we are especially grateful to be asked to join the vibrations of persons such as you, and that means of sharing the Creator's love might be experienced by your people so that we might learn more ways to express the infinite love and understanding of the one who made all of us. For are we not all children within that kingdom of creation? Some have wandered from the flock, so to speak. Some have chosen, that is the right of each to turn their backs upon the Creator for a while, so that individual expression in some area might be experienced. Each creation, each entity within the universe makes a journey throughout their existence. This journey is a path of learning. Much may be learned in many fields. Much may be experienced at many times. The possibilities are infinite. Our purpose at this time is to offer the understanding that is the foundation of all learning. The learning eventually by each within creation that each is the creator that each has within the divine spark of the one who made us all. We seek to share our simple understanding of this basic fact with those of you who wish to learn more of the secrets of their own existence.
We wish you to understand utter simplicity in which we come. We do not have a complex story to tell. We speak one word, and that is love. The original thought that created all that there is, is love. This simple and consuming fire is the fire of creation, is the fire of change, of transformation, and of infinity. There is no end to love. You may think of love in many ways. There are many words for love in many languages, and many different words have been used by your people to attempt to express the plentitude of the original thought. For love is all that there is. Thus, we are not only your brothers and sisters, we and you are one, for we are love. Look into the face of the one that is next to you, my friends. You are seeing love. Perhaps the mirror has been distorted. Perhaps sometimes the face next to yours does not know that it is the face of love. But there is no consciousness that is not love. There is a consciousness that touches each of you. One word for it is Christ consciousness. Another word is love. You may feel it personally as the touch of a loved one, hand on your shoulder, close, near, never away. You cannot flee from love. You cannot be separated from love, for you are love. Love is closer to you than your body. Each breath is farther from your being than is love. This is what we come to share. For we of the confederation of those in service to the infinite creator have one desire, to serve you by offering you the only information that is worthwhile. We will answer any question that you may have, but the simple truth is that all questions dissolve into a dying fall as they reach the ocean of infinite and all-encompassing love.